Howdy folks, howdy, Sean Brock here with you. Something a little bit different today. We're going to do a microphone shootout, a subject very near and dear to the hearts of every acoustic musician worth his or her salt. And if you haven't subscribed, please do so. I would certainly appreciate it. So today we're going budget versus big money. Not real big money, but big money. Uh, we're going with the Samson C02 on the budget end, which is what I've got in front of me right now. You guys have seen them on a lot of videos. And then we're going to go with the Neumann KM184, which is probably my favorite small diaphragm microphone uh, ever made. And yes, I like uh, DPAs and Shopes and all kind of stuff. Uh, but that Neumann is something that I've kind of been familiar with and using for about 25 years. And I'm a little partial to them. So to give you an idea of the price range, the C02 Samson is about 130 to 150 US. The Neumann KM184s. Uh, are a little more expensive. You're looking at uh, approximately about $1,450, $1,500 US to get those. So we're going to try to be short and we're just going to try to give you an idea of what both of these sound like. Samson's C02. Norman KM-184. So here are my observations. Here's one very important thing. Uh, obviously the, the KM184 has a lot more output going on. So I should have turned the preamp down, but that would give us different color. Uh, so while playing the rhythm, I couldn't open up my, my normal, and I'm going to clip when I do this, but my normal would have been... <laughs> hear clipping like crazy in my headphones nevertheless there's our comparison another thing i would say is typically when i use a km184 i do a little bit different i do a little more off axis uh slightly uh slightly different position but i want to use the same position uh, another comment i'll make is the km184 is more uh, more forgiving if, if you're kind of wondering and don't know how to position mics very well. You know we can do we can do some some crazy stuff. We can get down here we can we can get up here you know and still yet you know 
and, and the Samsungs are extremely good. Sorry for the racket. Here, let's let's get this one way down low here. So you can see, I mean, the the yeah, sure, the sound changes, but it's still very. Very balanced, very uh, good sound, uh, even even with some craziness, some less than optimal positioning. Uh, the Normans also are a little, a lot better uh, for long range. Uh, used them a lot. I used to do some recording like the Cincinnati Symphony Orchestra. Uh, and used Normans on that. Um, just a very versatile, good microphone. But it's a lot more expensive. No doubt about it. The, uh, the Samsung is a, Samson is an excellent value, in my opinion. You know, less than $150, man. And I've had those things since, like, 2010. And they've been all around the country out on some gigs when I lived in Las Vegas you know they were out in the outdoors I've had them on some bluegrass festivals when it rained uh, unlike some brands like MXL they uh, they hold up I'm very very amazed by the rugged build of, of the Samsons but there is a difference and there should be for $1,300 Anyway, Sean Brock, I hope you've enjoyed this. You got any questions, comments, please leave them in the description box. I always enjoy talking to you guys about things. And uh, like I said, please subscribe if, uh, if you don't mind. I would certainly appreciate it. Take care. And unfortunately, they pick up children.